Welcome to the longest running quiz show in the area. Categories. High school students compete to answer questions on topics from art to science, history to current events. And now, here's your Categories host, John Bartell. Hi, welcome to Categories. Today we have a matchup between the first two Shawnee Mission schools as the Shawnee Mission North Indians take on the Shawnee Mission East Lancers. Let's go ahead and meet our contestants first from North. I'm Thomas and I'm a senior. My name is Brian Blood and I'm a senior. I'm Wyatt and I'm a freshman. I'm Brian, I'm a senior. I'm Braden and I'm a senior. And our contestants from East. I'm Ian, I'm a senior. I'm Charlie B and I'm a junior. I'm Raymond and I'm a junior. I'm Abigail and I'm a freshman. I'm Charlie C and I'm a sophomore. Here on categories in the first round, we are going to take turns answering questions from several different categories. If a team answers correctly, of course, they will earn a point for their school. If they answer incorrectly, the other team will get a chance to steal that category. We did a coin toss before we started recording. It was won by the Lancers, so Shawnee Mission East. Here is the first category. It is general knowledge. It is also known as Tai Chi 2 and appears on the flag of South Korea. What is the more common Western name for this symbol of the conflict and unity between light and darkness? Raymond. The Dow. Sorry, cannot accept that. Indians, chance to steal. Brian B. Uh, yin and Yang. Yin and Yang, very good. Indians, staying with you with economics. Which of the following, so it's a multiple choice, which of the following is a good example of a progressive tax? Is it a sales tax? an excise tax, a real estate tax, or an income tax? Brian. Income tax. It is income tax. Back over to you, Lancers. Poetry is the category. Finish this stanza from the poem by William Henley. It goes like this. It matters not how straight the gate, how charged with punishment the scroll. I am the master of my fate. I am the captain of my blank. Ian. Soul. It is soul. Back over to you, North. Musicals is the category. King Arthur of Britain and Sir Lancelot the Homicidally Brave are characters from which musical? Brian B. Knights of the Round Table. Cannot accept that. Lancers, chance to steal this musicals category. King Arthur of Britain and Sir Lancelot. Abigail. Spam a lot. It is spam a lot. Very good. Staying with you, East. Science, specifically chemistry, is the category. What chemical element? has the atomic number of 19 and the atomic weight of approximately Charlie C. Potassium. It is potassium. Back over to you, Indians. Literature. John Steinbeck wrote two novels that mention foodstuffs in their titles. Name either one of them. Thomas. Uh, Grapes of Wrath. Grapes of Wrath. The other one is Tortilla Flat. Back over to you, Lancers. Current events is the category. Name the leader of the terrorist group ISIS who was killed in, the, in a U.S. military raid in Syria. Ian? Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi. Very good. Back to you, North. General knowledge. Polystyrene that has been bubbled up to make drinking cups and packaging supports is called what? Thomas. Styrofoam. Styrofoam. Back to you, Lancers. Fine arts. Paintings is the category. It's a fairly long question. There's a famous painting with interesting models by Grant Wood. To, de to depict the ideals of rural America, Wood wanted to use his mother Hattie as a model for his painting. Wood determined that the standing for so long would make it far too exhausting, so he used his sister, who wore his mother's apron and a pin while posing. For the male subject of the painting, Wood used his 62-year-old dentist. Name this painting. Abigail. American Gothic. American Gothic, very good. Indians, back to you, U.S. Geography. What North Dakota city was named for a pioneer in the overland shipping business? Wyatt? Fargo. It is Fargo. Back to you, East, U.S. Geography. The world's most secure prison was located on an island in San Francisco Bay. Raymond. Alcatraz? It is Alcatraz. Back to you, North, sports. What school holds the record for the most consecutive NCAA Division I basketball championships for men? 
Thomas. Uh, University of Kansas. I'm sorry, that's incorrect. Lancers, chance to steal this sports category. Charlie B. UCLA. UCLA. National championships from all the way from 67 to 73. Lancers, staying with you, history is the category. In the 1960s, 70s, and 80s, the Soviet Union attacked foreign aircraft at an average rate of one per year. One of the best known incidents occurred in 1960, when what type of American spy plane was shot down over the Soviet Union? Charlie B. U-2. The U-2. Back to you, Indians. Mathematics. On a standard die, the numbers on opposite sides add up to what number? Thomas? Seven. It is seven. Back to you, East. U.S. government. What percent of the popular vote must a third-party presidential candidate get in order to qualify for public financing? Ian? Five. It is five. You knew that one, right? There we go. Back to you, Indians. History, another history question. What European nation gave America the most hope during the Revolutionary War? Braden? Uh, France. It is France. Back, back to you, Lancers. Mathematics is the category. Give the only three regular polygons that tessellate. Raymond. Triangle, square, and hexagon. Those are the three. Back to you, Indians. Current events is the category. Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau won re-election, but his party lost its majority in Parliament. Name his political party. Brian P. Liberal. Yep, yeah, that is correct. Back to you, East. Sports. On what two pieces of apparatus do only female gymnasts perform? Charlie B. Bar and Matt. Cannot accept that. Indians, chance to steal the sports category. On what two pieces of apparatus do only female gymnasts perform? Brian B. Floor and balance beam. That's incorrect. Balance beam is one of them. The other is uneven bars. The uneven bars. Indians, we are staying with you. Science is the category. Chromosomes appear within the nucleus in the initial phase of mitosis. Name that phase. Thomas. Prophase. It is prophase. East, back to you. Vocabulary. The word is a noun beginning with the letter D. Its definition, literary and dramatic propri propriety, propriety and good taste in, con in conduct or appearance. Charlie C. Decorum. Decorum, very good. Back to you, Indians. Language is the category. People of Dutch ancestry who live in South Africa are often called Boers. Boer is a Dutch word meaning what? Brian B. White. I cannot accept that. Lancers, chance to steal this language category. People of Dutch ancestry who live in South Africa are often called Boers. Boer is a Dutch word meaning what? Raymond. Settler? It's not settler. Farmer. Farmer. Staying with you, East, U.S. history is the next category. In American history, what was known as the Noble Experiment. Raymond. Democracy? Cannot accept democracy. North, chance to steal this U.S. history question. In American history, what was known as the Noble Experiment? Braden. The Articles of Confederation? Cannot accept that either. Prohibition. Prohibition was the Noble Experiment. Indians, we are staying with you. Geography is the next category. It is the parallel of latitude 66 and a half degrees south of the equator and 23 and a half degrees north of, from the South Pole. What do we call that latitude? Wyatt? Antarctic Circle. Antarctic Circle, very good. Back to you, Lancers. Media and journalism is the category. Which newspaper bills itself as, quote, the daily diary of the American dream? Raymond? The New York Times? It is not the New York Times. 
Indians chance to steal this media and journalism question. Which newspaper bills itself as, quote, the daily diary of the American dream? Brian B. The New Yorker? It is not the New Yorker. It's the Wall Street Journal. The Wall Street Journal. Indians, staying with you, business terminology is the category. What four-letter word, beginning with the letter C, means to give up one's rights in or transfer ownership of? Thomas. Seed. Seed. Very nice. Back to you, Lancers. World geography is the category. The Java Trench. Java Trench is located in what ocean? Raymond. Indian Ocean? It is the Indian Ocean. North, back to you, U.S. history. Texas was an independent nation for 10 years. Name any one of those 10 years. Brian B. 1845. 1845 is within the window. 36 to 46 was that time. Lancers, coming back to you, sports is the category. Name the swimming event which requires the use of four different strokes, including breaststroke, backstroke, butterfly, and freestyle. Charlie B. Medley. It is a medley. Back to you, Indians. Vocabulary. What eight word, excuse me, eight letter word means hatred of women? Brian B. Misogyny. Misogyny. Kind of a downer question, sorry about that. Back to you, East. Science. Psychology is the category. It has been debated for centuries whether personality is largely genetic or environmental in origin. This conflict has been encapsulated in the phrase of similar sounding words. Charlie C. Nature versus nurture. Very good. Back to you, Indians. History. History of inventions, actually. This moderately priced automo automobile first sold for $850. Then its production was streamlined, so the price came down to $250. An extremely popular vehicle, it was manufactured for a 19-year period. What was the make and model of this car? Brian B. Ford Model T. The Ford Model T. Very good. Back to you, Lancers. European history this time. What nation is the oldest democracy in Northern Europe? Ian. United Kingdom. It is not the United Kingdom. Indians, chance to steal this European history question. What nation is the oldest democracy in Northern Europe? Brian B. Iceland. It is not Iceland. Switzerland. Switzerland. Staying with you, Indians, next category for you is Proverbs. I'll explain it prosaically and you recite the proverb. Here it goes. When a person in authority is gone, those under the person's rule will enjoy their freedom. Thomas? And the cat's away, the mice will play. That's exactly what we're looking for. Very good. And that, uh, that little tone in the background does denote the end of our first round, a very well played round, with a score right now of Shawnee Mission North 15 to Shawnee Mission East 14. At this part of our program, we are going to go to a member of each team as they will give us a campus update. And Brian B., you are giving us the update for the Indians. Yeah, so our uh, band just finished their uh, marching season and are moving into our competition. Our football team has their playoff game uh, this Friday. Our uh, student council is starting their canned food drive for the Johnson County Christmas Bureau. And the National Honor Society is holding a book drive currently. So lots of stuff. Absolutely. All right. Okay, and Ian, you're giving us the update from Shawnee Mission East, so what's the latest? Uh, well, the latest is very similar to last week when I gave this last update. Um, football, no, 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 sorry, uh, soccer is in the playoffs. Um, uh, student ca our, our can driver student council for the Johnson County Christmas Bureau is in full swing from we started it last week. And it's Halloween, so there's generally spooky stuff going around uh, all, this, uh, all throughout the school, uh, like orchestra held its uh, pop-up Halloween concert during lunch. Oh, well, that's pretty cool. Yeah. All right. Awesome. Great stuff happening 
at both schools. As we begin here, our second round, our second round is our lightning round, and traditionally here on Categories, we will start with our look and listen question. Our look and listen question will be displayed for our contestants here in the studio, as well on the screen for those who are watching at home. The look and listen question is worth two points. And just as a reminder, when someone rings in, that's where we need to stop the video and go from there. And please wait until I am finished reading the question before ringing in. So here we go. Here is our look and listen question. The category is, oh, excuse me, there is no category. Let's go, let's move on to the question. Name the notables who are customar who customarily appear in, this, in celebration on this terrace. Let me read that again. Name the notables who customarily appear in celebration on this terrace. Ian. Uh, the British Royal Family. The British Royal Family is exactly what we're looking for. Two points to Shawnee Mission East. As we continue with our lightning round, questions will be placed on the floor for either team to answer. Just like the first round, if a team answers correctly, they will earn a point. If they answer incorrectly, the other team will get a chance to steal the category. Both teams, mathematics is the category. Hands on buzzers. To evaluate x to the ninth power divided by x to the third power, what do you do with the exponents? Thomas. Subtract. You subtract them. U.S. geography for both teams. In North America, the continental divide, continental divide is a watershed created by the mountains and tablelands of what mountain range? Brian B. The Rocky Mountains. It is the Rocky Mountains. Fine arts, painters, multiple choice. What Spanish painter is often referred to as both the last of the old masters and the first of the moderns? Charlie B. Pablo Picasso. Sorry, cannot accept that. Indians chance to steal this fine arts and painters category. What Spanish painter is often referred to as both the last of the old masters and the first of the moderns? Is it Salvador Dali, Francisco Goya, Joan Miro, or El Greco? Braden. Uh, Salvador Dali. I'm sorry, it's Francisco Goya. Both teams, U.S. government is the category. How was the U.S. delegate to the United Nations chosen? Ian? Appointed by the president. Appointed by the president. Language, word origin is the category. In Latin, non compos mentis means not of sound mind. What slang word for idiot comes from non compos mentis and is derived from Raymond? Nincompoop. It is nincompoop, yes. It's my favorite question. General knowledge. General knowledge is the category. The top line of an eye test consists of this one letter. Charlie C. E. It is an E. Fine arts, composers. In the late 19th century, composers began destroying tonal tonality in music, many by the use of chromaticism. What German composer was the first and most famous proponent of chromaticism. Chromaticism. Ian. Beethoven. It's not Beethoven. Indians chance to steal this fine arts composer's question. In the, light, in the late 19th century, composers began destroying tonality in music and many, many by the use of chromaticism. Thomas. Bach. Wagner. Wagner is the correct answer. U.S. history, presidents to be specific. Who was the first Democratic president elected in the 20th century? Raymond? Theodore Roosevelt? I'm sorry, that's incorrect. Indians, chance to steal this U.S. history president's question. Who was the first Democratic president elected in the 20th century? Braden. Woodrow Wilson? It is Woodrow Wilson. World geography for both teams. What nation is surrounded by Somalia, Ethiopia, South Sudan, Uganda, and Tanzania? Yeah. Wyatt, go ahead. Kenya. It is Kenya. We have a tie score at 19 apiece with just under eight minutes to go. Vocabulary and spelling. Plants may be classified according to their water requirements. requirements. For instance, many may be found in the Mojave Desert are called xerophytes. 
Spell zero fights. Ian. X E R O P H Y T E S. That is exactly right. Current events is the next category for both teams. California lawmakers voted to ban the sale and manufacture of these type of products as of 2013. Brian P. Plastic bags. Can you repeat that, please? Uh, plastic bags. Cannot accept that. Lancers, you have a chance to steal. Plastic straws. It's not plastic straws, it's animal fur products. Animal fur products. Both teams, science, meteorology for both teams. Why do Syracuse, Rochester, and Buffalo, New York routinely receive a greater annual snowfall than any other large city? Brian B. Uh, lake effect snow. Lake effect snow, very good. Sports for both teams. What professional NBA basketball team shares its name with a car part? Brian B. The Pistons. It is the Pistons. Economics for both teams. An economic recession is technically defined as how many consecutive quarters of negative growth? Ian. Two. It is two. Science, physics for both teams. If a liquid resists flowing freely, it is said to have a high level, Thomas. Viscosity. Viscosity. High level of viscosity. World history, explorers. Vasco da Gama's voyage to India, the discovery of Florida, or Magellan's trip around the world. Which came first? Raymond? Magellan's trip around the world? I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Indians, chance to steal this world history explorers question. Vasco da Gama's voyage to India, the discovery of Florida, or Magellan's trip around the world. Which came first? No, you see that, Brian, Brian, you did ring in. You're okay. Okay. Um, Vasco da Gama's voyage to India. Vasco da Gama's, that's correct. World geography. World geography. Yes, the next category is world geography. Of these four small countries in Europe, Andorra, Liechtenstein, San Marino, and Monaco, which is the smallest? Ian? Monaco. Monaco is. Literature for both teams. Identify the title character of H.G. Wells' 1897 novel, who, ha who was heard more than seen. Charlie C. The Invisible Man. It is The Invisible Man. Tie score at 23 apiece. General knowledge for both teams. Who invented the Kodak camera? Brian B. Kodak. It is not Kodak. Lancers, chance to steal this general knowledge question. Who invented the Kodak camera? Raymond? John Newton? Nope. It's George Eastman. Eastman. Music, notation is the next category. If a composer wants you to play notes very short and detached. Raymond? Staccato? Cannot accept staccato. <sighs> Indians, chance to steal this music notation category. If a composer wants you to play notes very short and detached, which sign will he put under or above the notes? Thomas? Mercado. Can I accept that? We're looking for just a dot, a dot above or below the note. Science, biology for both teams. Which of the following are cell organelles found in plant cells but not in animal cells? Charlie C. Cell wall. Sorry, I cannot accept that. Indians, chance to steal the science and biology question. Which of the two, or excuse me, which two of the following are cell organelles found in plant cells but not in animal cells? Lysosomes, cell wall, nuclei, chloroplast, mitochondria. Brian B. Chloroplast. Chloroplast and cell wall. That's the two, yes. Vocabulary for both teams. <clears throat> Throwing a custard pie into someone's face is what kind of humor? Ian? Slapstick. It is slapstick. Economics for both teams. Identify this hyphenated name. They comprise of 30 industrial stocks, 20 transportation stocks, 15 utilities, and a composite of the 65 stocks. Raymond? S&P 500? Cannot accept that. 
Indians, chance to steal this economics question, identify this hyphenated name. They comprise of 30 industrial stocks, 20 transportation stocks, 15 utilities, and a composite of the 65 stocks. Brian. A mutual fund? Cannot accept that. We're looking for the Dow Jones averages. Dow Jones averages. Famous artists for both teams. His remarkable illustrations for an edition of Treasure Island made him famous. Name this artist. N.C. Wyeth. And we're just under two minutes. U.S. Geography. Cities. Texas has the, excuse me, let's start over. Dallas is the second largest city in Texas. What city is the largest in Texas? Charlie B. Houston. It is Houston. European history for both teams. Were the small farmers and tradesmen of the Roman Empire called plebeians, patricians, or equestrians? Raymond? Plebeians. They are plebeians. Science, astronomy for both teams. The most dominant of many craters seen on the moon is accompanied by a spectacular rays. What is the name of this prominent crater? Charlie C. Sea of Tranquility. I cannot accept Sea of Tranquility. Indians, chance to steal this science astronomy question. The most dominant of the many craters seen on the moon is accompanied by spectacular rays. What is the name of this prominent crater? This Tycho, named after Tycho Brahe. Shakespeare is the next category for both teams. Name any of the three Shakespearean plays usually designated as dark or tragic comedies. Braden. Um. Macbeth. Cannot accept Macbeth. Lancers, chance to steal this Shakespearean category. Name any of the three. Ian. The Tempest. Cannot accept that either. Measure for all measure, all's well that ends well, or Troilus and Cressida. Fine arts paintings for both categories. Much like the Mona Lisa, the subject of Johann Vermeer's Girl with a Pearl Earring has been highly contested. But for most likely candidate, Vermeer didn't have to look far. Who was the model for his painting? Raymond? The... Uh, the Medici? I cannot accept that. Indians, chance to steal this category. Fine arts and paintings is the category. Much like the Mona Lisa, the subject of Johann Vermeer's Girl with a Pearl Earring has been highly contested. But for the most likely candidate, Vermeer did not have to look far. Brian B. Johann Vermeer. No, it was his daughter. It was his daughter. During that question, we did have the ending sound for our game, and it was a tightly contested game. Both teams scoring really well, but Shawnee Mission East comes out on top with a final score of 26 to Shawnee Mission North 24. Please join us again here next time on Categories as we will continue to bring you the best and brightest minds of high school students throughout Johnson County.